90% AR. Is it reachable? Is it reachable today? We're going to take every order, no matter how bad it is, and try to get to 90%. Stay tuned. All right, good morning, everyone. Dashing Dink here, and we are in the mall parking lot, our favorite place to park. However, we just got an order for Country Kitchen, $5.50 going 0.8 miles. Now, today's video is gonna be about getting our AR to 90% or more. So I'm gonna accept every order. Now, it's not a very fair video to do because once again, we have a peak pay. I didn't realize it until I just opened up the app. It's $1.50 per order until 9.59 in the morning. Just wanted to let you guys know what's going on. We'll see how long it takes us to get there. We got our first order. So we're gonna head over to Country Kitchen. We're gonna grab it. and We're gonna get this show on the road. Just recorded that, so. Oh, I don't care. It's good. It's good. Put it on my. Goes on my YouTube channel. Oh, good. <laughs> All right, everyone. So I literally only had to go a block and a half to drop this country kitchen order off, and when I got here. They were coming out to start their car, so I just had to quickly grab the order and hand it to them. So I didn't even have time to grab the camera. Okay, we are back in the mall parking lot, our favorite place to park. And I wanted to ask you guys something, and if you could leave your comments down below, that would be awesome. Um, should I do a live like once a week or once every two weeks or something like that? I've been kind of pondering it and I do have all of the things set up at home. I've got a camera and a mic and a computer and all that stuff in my office downstairs. Um, so I was just curious if you guys would want me to go live, if you'd like the chit chat. Uh, we can talk about gig stuff, we can talk about DoorDash stuff, Instacart stuff. Um, we can talk about any of the gig apps. I'm curious about those other apps. I'm really curious about Spark. I wish I've signed up for it. It's not available in my area at the moment. Um, I signed up for the one that uh, Target does, but that also is not available in my area. I think it's just too small uh, of a market right now. Hey guys, I'm staring right into the sun. Sorry for the squinting. But we just got a 650 going, oh man, two. 2.4 or 2.7 miles, something like that. I can't remember. Thank you. Okay. We got Caden's order in the hot bag in the back. I will take screenshots of my ratings uh, after each one of these deliveries just so that we can see where we're setting. Um, so as soon as we drop this off, I'll go in and look, I'll take a screenshot, we'll see if we've gone up from 87 or not. Took me almost 12 minutes to get a picture to that person. Picture wouldn't go through. Text message wouldn't go through. I had to reset my phone twice. It's like, what in the world? I had thousands of bars of service. And it just kept coming up. DoorDash, error, blah, 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 whatever the error number was. I'm like, what a freaking piece of trash. Happens all the time so stinking frustrating 
Meanwhile, their food's sitting outside getting cold. Ridiculous. I was just gonna drive instead of going back to the mall parking lot, which is our favorite place to park. And I told you I'd take every order. I just got a $9.32 order to get 13 items, I think it was, from Aldi. It was either 11 or 13 items from Aldi. Okay, everybody, we got that shopped. Um, I didn't even look at the time, but it was probably five minutes. Then we got a stack for $6.50 to pick up from Taco Bell. And I did not look at the mileage on that, but I'm hoping it's going to the same place. Um, I didn't even look. So we're heading over to Taco Bell now, pick up the uh, food delivery order, and then we'll go get these taken care of. All right, man. Thanks, guys. Take it easy. Okay, everyone. We got the pickup for Quinn from Taco Bell. It's in the uh, hot bag, actually, right next to me here. And then we've got the Aldi's order in the back seat. So we're heading over to Quinn right now to drop off the food. All right, Quinn, thank you very much for your order. I appreciate your business. Enjoy your Taco Bell and have a wonderful day. Okay, everybody, um, so we got the Taco Bell dropped off, we got the Aldi's dropped off, and I was just on my way back towards the mall parking lot, which is our favorite place to park, and I received a 650, I believe, from Burger King to go two point some miles, and I checked the stats. The AR has not changed yet. We're still at 87% and we've done like four or five orders now. <laughs> so I'm hoping it changes pretty soon, but um, let's head over to Burger King and get this ordered. All right, everyone, we got the Burger King dropped off to Josh. And I just checked the stats, took a screenshot, and we finally went up to 88%. It only took us like five deliveries. <laughs> so now they'll probably go up fast. Okay, guys, we were on our way back to the mall parking lot, which I just passed. It's our favorite place to park. And I received a uh, 750 to go three miles from Country Kitchen. Pretty sure that's what it was, so we're heading over to Country Kitchen now. Let's go get this order and see if our acceptance rate climbs again.
Okay, everyone. <laughs> well, we dropped off that country kitchen order. I haven't checked the stats yet, but we just accepted a McDonald's going 12.6 miles for $5.73. So I told you I'd take them all, no matter if they were good or bad. So let's go get this McDonald's. I'll check the stats and we'll see if we've gone up. Okay, we picked up the McDonald's, but I did look. Uh, so before we dropped this one off, I took a screenshot. We did go up to 89% after we dropped off that country kitchen. And so we will check once we drop this one off if we've made it to 90. Okay, everyone, we got that McDonald's dropped off. Um, I apologize for not recording it. We were out in the middle of nowhere, and I was on a rough, rough road. So I knew that the uh, bouncy quality of the video would be bad. But anyway, for some reason, my dash ended. I've had to reset the app three times today, so I don't know if they're doing updates or whatever on DoorDash, but I've had nothing but problems. So anyway, for I'm going to wait to restart it until we get back into the zone. But um, so far, we're sitting at like $47.63. Uh, we've been out here for two hours and 40 minutes. So we're at about 19 bucks an hour. Not real good. But it is what it is. Um, it does say that Bemidji is busy right now. So once we get back to the zone, we'll go ahead and fire the app back up. We're setting an 89% completion rating. I did check after that order. It did not go up to 90. Okay, everyone, we just got back into the zone and we got an order, $4.01. And I can't even remember how many miles it was from McDonald's. So I went ahead and took it. We're heading down the highway and we'll get over to McDonald's and pick it up. Thank you. Okay, everyone, we got that order dropped off, as you saw, and immediately we received a $5.50 from Country Kitchen. Again, I did not look at the miles. We're just taking everything today. Um, but I did check the ratings, and after we dropped off that McDonald's back there, we're still at 89%. So it's been, what, two orders now? We still haven't gone up uh, to 90 but Country Kitchen is just uh, about a block away. So let's go grab that order and we'll see if we go up to 90 on this one. Will. All right, thanks guys. Have a good one. Okay, we dropped off the Country Kitchen and now we just received an 850 going 3.8 miles to Tapatio's Mexican restaurant. So we're gonna head over to Tapatio's. Um, let me check the ratings really quick. I didn't have a chance to do that after that drop off. We're still at 89%. So as soon as we hit 90, I'll take a screenshot. Hi, DoorDash for... Okay. okay. Hi, 
Liola? All right, thank you so much. Um, I'll take it. Thanks. Appreciate it. All right, we just dropped off the Tapatios Mexican Restaurante to a nice young man at the door. I don't know if you guys saw that or not. Um, our rating is still at 89, but we just accepted a Perkins order for $6.02 to go six miles. So, But once we get to Perkins, it's probably only going to be like four and a half miles. But let's go pick up Perkins and get it to the customer. Order for Eliana. Just the one bag? Yeah. Okay. Alright, here you go. Alright, thank you so yeah. much. Have a good day. Yeah, you too. Oh, okay. Eliana? Yes. How are you? I'm doing wonderful. Looks like you're getting some lunch. Yes, indeed. All right, thank you. Thank you. Yep, you have a wonderful day. All right, everyone, I just wanted to get you some footage of our lake. I'm just going off of the shore. You can see the shoreline right here. And now I'm walking on the lake. See the shoreline coming around? And I wanted to show you, look at the little houses out there. Those are fish houses. People set them up, they drill holes through the ice, and they put heat in the houses, and then they fish. As you can see, there's people driving out here. We probably have about 18 inches of ice on the lake right now. Looks like a barren wasteland, doesn't it? All right, I just wanted to show you. All right, everyone, we're going to do some quick closing statements. Um, we finally reached 90%. We did it on that last order that uh, we dropped off at the pet grooming place. Uh, Canine Divine is what it was called. But we brought the Perkins in. We hit 90. So that's going to be our video for today. But stay tuned because we're going to roll this thing. We're going to take every order until we hit 100%. So this will be a little series of videos here. So stick around and check it out. Uh, on the day, we worked three and a half hours. And, well, about three hours and 40 minutes. And we did like 72 bucks. So not horrible. Not bad. Um, well over 20 bucks an hour. So I'll take it. It was a successful day. I want to thank everybody for subscribing, commenting, liking, um, Remember, if you guys want me to go live, just uh, let me know in the comments down below. I'll read them, and uh, we'll make a decision from there. So, Dashing Dink saying, have a wonderful day. Signing off, and until the next Dash. Bye, everyone.